Uh, it was good, um, long, but a very good, productive summer. You get much downtime at all? Uh, I mean, yeah, I didn't, I didn't do too much. Just work out, uh, enjoy family time, friends. That's pretty much it. Clay, you're a guy who's increased his numbers and improved so much every off season. Was there anything specifically that you concentrated on this past off season? Uh, just becoming a leader. Uh, just making sure I know what's going on on the floor, uh, every position. Uh, just, just getting ready to really uh, get my mentality of just leading this group this year, and it's uh, pretty much it. Uh, obviously, all the other aspects of my game, I work on everything this summer. Uh, don't really focus on one thing. What, what did you learn from Tim Duncan about leadership? Uh, I learned a lot of uh, just him by by him making me better. Uh, just really listening to him, uh, some things that Pop telling me as well. But just knowing that, uh, just knowing that he, I knew that he knew the game, and just seeing how he talked to players or just guys like myself, and just getting able to just get me pushing forward for a uh, title. How strange is it? Just to, I know it's different, but to just not see him out here. It takes you getting used to, I guess, huh? Oh yeah, that's the first practice today. Um, like I said yesterday, uh, you just right now we don't know what we're gonna miss on the floor just because we haven't been through the season yet. But uh, just now, just knowing that he's not here, his personality isn't here, uh, jokes that he makes during practice. So um, that's what things I'm missing him on right now. The makeup of this team, of course, is different. But most people think you know you guys are only behind Golden State. Um, mm. How do you think? Things have shaped up, and is it a team still built for a championship? Oh, for sure. I mean, uh, it starts with uh, me and that life first. And if we won a championship, this is going to be up to us to lead the group. And, uh, you know, our mindset is focused on winning and uh, getting uh, better at each step. So, um, definitely our competitive group. Do you think with a different look at the team this year, there's going to be different things asked of you personally? Uh, no, not really. Uh, I led us both on offensive and defensive end last year, but I mean, it's just going to be the same thing this year. Uh, just taking the approach of being a leader, like I said, and uh, setting the um, pace and example um, once that tip off starts. Did you enjoy your ride in the Indy car? Oh, yeah, it was fun. Uh, just being able to be on, uh, in the same car as Mario is great. How fast did he go, do you know? I think it went between, I'll say, 190 to 210. Yeah. <laughs> was, it, was it frightening at all? Like, uh, mm, not really. Uh, you know, he, he did a great job of, uh, we did a warm-up lap, so he probably was going about 60, 70 or miles like that. And then the second lap, he picked it up. But it wasn't really too scary. It was, it was, pretty, it was like a roller coaster ride. It was pretty fun. I know it's just been one practice, but... Uh, uh, what do you see that the, that Powell is going to be able to, to do in stepping into the starting spot for the team? Oh man, him just having uh, two championships, uh, you know, under his belt and uh, being in the league and having that knowledge, I think he'll fit right in. He's a team guy. He wants to win. Uh, he's very skilled. So um, you know, that's what type of players we like. Why would you, what did you kind of work on here in this offseason to get to, to raise your game here? This coming up season? Uh, just fundamentals. Uh, that's all you could work on, try to keep sharpening up your footwork. Just all aspects, shooting, uh, knowing, uh, like, it's just a mental summer for me. Uh, just knowing uh, when to take over games, uh, when I need to shoot, when I need to pass, just things like that. Well, you talked about wanting to be more of a leader this year. Does being a new dad sort of play into that? Um, not really. I mean, I'm trying to uh, build on 10 guys that uh, just for one season and you know my daughter is a lifetime so it's a difference uh, between guys and a little girl. How has yeah. fatherhood been these first couple months? What you expected or has it, has it been uh, different in any way, surprising in any way? Um, I don't think anybody knows what to expect when uh, you know having a baby <laughs> but I mean it's fun. Uh, I know I have a I just got great support with my family helping me, and um, I mean, it's just a great feeling once you, uh, you know, have a child. You have any second thoughts about the Olympics? Uh, no, not at all. Yeah.
Can you help her participate in the future? Uh, yeah, hopefully. We'll see what happens. Did you watch much of the Olympic tournament? Uh, I caught a few games. You know, they come on at random times, so it's hard to keep up, but I uh, definitely caught a couple quarters here and there. Was the overriding reason Nicholas was a child? That Say that again? Was the overriding reason, you know, having a child? Oh, uh, I mean, one of the reasons, uh, but I mean, a lot of things came into play um, making that decision.